Karat Mundam, also Karati Mundam are the stories recited, sung by the shamans called Fedangma, Samba of the Karati ethnic groups of Nepal, Limba, Rai, Sunuwar and Yaka peoples of Nepal, India, Myanmar and now practiced in the UK, China, USA and many other countries. The practice is also known as Karat Veda, Karat Ko Veda or Karat Ko Ved. According to some scholars, such as Tom Woodhatch, it is a blend of animism e.g., ancestor worshipping of Sumnima, Paruhang and Yuma Samang, Tagara Ningwafuming, Savism. It is practiced by about 3.1% of the Nepali population. Before it was recognized as a religion on the Nepali census, 36% of the Karati population claimed to follow the Karat religion, but when it was recognized this figure increased to 73.9%, a 157% increase in the Nepali Karatas. Also, in addition to ancestor worship, Karanti people also worship Mother Nature. Religious texts Topic. It has the religious scripture and folk literature of the Karat people of Nepal. All four Karats Limba, Rai, Sunuwar and Yaka have slightly different religious texts. Religious texts means the power of great strength Mundam in the Limba language, Mewahong Rai call it Mudam, Yaka Rai is Mintam, Sunuwar is Mukdam among Kuling Rai is Ridam and Chamling Rai is Dum. It covers many aspects of the Karat culture, customs and traditions that existed before Vedic civilization in South Asia. The religious texts for each tribe consists of customs, habits, rituals, traditions, and myths passed down from the Karati tribe's ancestors. Religious texts serve, in a way, as customary laws which guide Karats in their daily lives. Their religious texts also distinguishes each Karanti tribe from other Karati and non karatis as well. Practices Karats practice shamanism and their rituals are mostly related to the worship of Mother Nature, ancestors, sun, moon, wind, fire and main pillar of house. Almost all sacred rituals, in Rai, are performed by Nakshang, the Rai tribal priest. Similarly Limbus have Fem, B, Eb per meter, Smibi per meter, to perform rituals accordingly. Their supreme deity Tagara Ningwafuma, Tijinyar Nifam is personified as Yuma Samang as female and Theba Samang as male in earthly form. Some Limbus have their own distinct form of worship known as Yuma Samang is mother of all the Limbus their follower or Yumaism, they venerate a supreme goddess. <laughs> Festivals all four Karats celebrate some similar and different festivals throughout the year. Some common festivals are Udhauli, Yubhauli and New Year Yele Sambat Sakela is the main festival of Kambu Karat Rai. .In this festival they worship Mother Nature and their ancestors who is believed to be staying in their chilla fireplace build by three stone, each stone has a unique meaning and garden. This festival is celebrated twice a year distinguished by two names Yubhauli and Udhauli. Sakela Yubhauli is celebrated during Baisak Purnima full moon day, which lies in the month of Baisak in calendars of the Indian subcontinent, and Sakela Udhauli is celebrated during the full moon day in the month of Mang. In Yubhauli they pray for the goodness of family and good weather for cultivation and in Udhauli they thanks the mother nature and ancestor for their blessing and good harvest. In both Yubhauli and Udhauli they sacrifice a rooster and worship by ginger, rice, homemade alcohol, and tree resin resin is put in the burning coal for fragrance and conduct a sakela dance. In this dance they performs all the daily life activity example planting rice, harvesting etc. and also try to copy the behavior of animals and birds which are part of their day-to-day -day life. The Limba Karat celebrate Udhauli Chasak Tangnam on the day of Mangsar Purnima and Yubhauli in the month of Baisak. Other Karats Yaka and Sunuwars also celebrate in their own way. Sakela celebration is the prayer to goddess of nature for good crops and protection from natural calamities. The celebration of Sakela is also known as Khandi Nach Marat. On Khandi Nach, they worship Durga, who is known to them as Khandi, or Chandika. Worship of Durga among the Himalayan Karatas is arguably written in the Harivamsha Purana. Durga Puja is still performed by a few currents. Tihar is another festival that was added first in the Veda. It is also known as Deepavali and Lakshmi Puja. See also 
Topic: Folk Hinduism. Religion in Nepal. Buddhism in Nepal. Hinduism in Nepal. Demographics of Nepal. Limba language. Topic. References. Topic. Topic. External links. Topic. Mundam Karat Yakthung Chumling. Mundam translations. Dances of the Karanti. Karanti Limbus in Qatar.